I wanted to come at you guys with a simple eyebrow tutorial. Um, the simplest that you will find on the internet and it is under $5. Okay, so an under $5 eyebrow tutorial, very quick and simple. And the products that you will need are a angle brush and kind of a thick one. This is an equal tools one that I got into in a set. The set was like $9.99 but you do not have to use this one. You can get any brush that is an angled brush like this. You can get one from like Target for maybe like a dollar, two dollars. Um, another clean one uh, but a little bit thinner one like this. I got this from the beauty supply store for a dollar. Uh, um, your favorite concealer. This is the bomb concealer to use for your eyebrows. This is my favorite. Um, this one is the LA Girl Pro HD concealer and this is in Fawn. This is my skin color and when I want a little highlight I use this one. This is cool tan but today I'm going to use the Fawn one. Um, this is optional uh, eyeshadow primer um, slash base to put on. I would suggest it because it keeps your um, eyeshadow, I mean your eyebrows in place. A pencil, and let me get a pencil. As you can see, I'm running out of this one, but this is the Nika K pencil in um, dark brown banging pencil. I've tried a lot of different pencils, and this one has I always come back to this one, my number one favorite. And last but not least, a um, uh, brown eyeshadow powder gel, whatever. Um, I also use this one. This is another one of my favorites, the e.l.f. eyebrow kit but this one is in medium and it's too it's not dark enough for me okay so let's get started okay so i've already um primed my eyebrow i put the um primer on this is as you can get this for also from also for i think 1.99 or 2.99 and i just put it over also what i did next is i took the concealer and put it up under here and i do that i really didn't need to do it because my eyebrows are freshly done but i do it for like when you have like little growing hairs growing back and you don't want to just do get your eyebrows in this out or you haven't got them done um, you put it under to kind of conceal your little hairs before you do it okay so after you finish priming your eyebrow and putting your concealer underneath what you're going to do next is and I'm going to be looking over here hopefully you guys can see let me move it over a bit okay you just take and your brow your pencil and follow the, and the way your eyebrow goes. And I don't know how anybody else do theirs, but this time, now just filling in a little bit, just a little really small strokes, just a little bit. Okay, and that's it. You do it that just that much. After that, you take your angle brush, you put a little bit in your powder, put some powder right there, put a little bit in, and you just go along there, and what you, to keep it looking natural, you don't keep dipping it in, you just take the what you have on the brush and just use that and just bring it a little bit in the front just a little bit but more so on this area okay it's looking a little crazy now so I'm gonna fill in my back part a little bit more so it's a little bit lighter than I want it to be Okay, looks crazy and uneven right now, but this is where this part comes in. So you take your clean angle brush and your concealer, and you just take a little bit of the concealer. I hate the way this is, but I don't feel like putting it on my hands. So I'm about to go somewhere, and okay, so I'll take a little bit, sweet little bit, and you just take it along there, along your bottom.
and clean it up and you take out what you did and bring it on down. Some people do this part and they use concealers that are extremely too light for their skin. They try to do the highlight look with their eyebrows end up looking glow in the dark. Make sure you blend that in really good. Okay. Then you take it. I don't know if y'all can see my baby in the background, but yes, he's there. Okay, so you take it and you take it along the top. Now this is also optional. Everybody, I just do it because I like it to have a very clean and precise look and it doesn't have to be perfect, but yes, it needs to be along the lines of the top of your eyebrow. And you don't have to touch your hair, just get you know, just the extra, just to clean it up. Take it up. Blend that in. Okay. And I'm going to be putting my foundation on after this next. So, Tuki, what are you doing? What are you doing? And you take your eyebrow brush. I normally use a spoolie, but my spoolie dropped in the toilet. I'm never using that again, so I have to get a new one. So, But this works just as well for me. Just take your brush. And just brush it. And brush it along the front just to give that, that light looking look. And this is your finished look. Very neat and natural looking eyebrows. And it doesn't take long. And like I said, it is all these products for the most part you can get for under $5. Okay? Alright, so thank you guys for watching. Hope this was a useful tutorial for you guys. And don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. Bye.